If you are new to DaVinci Resolve you may face a couple of issues with the mono track. One issue is that you get sound only in the left channel or on the left side of the headphone. Another issue is when you have only one track, your track sound level and bus sound level do not match. I will show you how to fix those issues. I will increase the height of the track a bit by dragging. I also want the timeline to expand a bit horizontally, so I will use this slider. I think this is okay. I will play the clip a bit and keep an eye on the mixer for different sound levels in the bus and track. I have decided to make some audio editing tutorials with DaVinci Resolve. Normally I make audio editing tutorials with Audacity, but I think DaVinci Resolve is much more capable in audio editing. You can see a difference in the volume meters where the bus was lower than the track. The bus is the final output of all the tracks combined. Here I have only one track, so the bus volume should be equal to the track volume. You can export only the track instead of the bus while you are exporting the audio, but there can be a problem with that approach. The volume level you hear during audio editing in DaVinci Resolve is the bus volume level. So if you export the track where bus volume and track volume are different, your result may not be the one you wanted. If I mute the bus during playback, you will see you are hearing the bus volume. I have decided to make some audio. Normally, I make audio editing due to audacity, but I think the result is much more in audio. Whenever I muted the bus, you heard nothing. So, how do we fix this inconsistent volume level in the bus and track? The audio track I am using is a mono track and you have to convert it to a stereo track. Right click inside this track panel and you will see an option to change the track type. Please note this step can be skipped if you have more than one track. Because when you have more than one track, the bus volume level does not need to be the same as every track. With multiple tracks, bus volume is the combined volume of the tracks. So this step is necessary only when you are working with a single track in DaVinci Resolve. Click on the stereo and it will become a stereo track. It has become a stereo track and an equal space is created beneath the channel. Before converting to a stereo track, this channel was covering all the heights of the track. Now it has left the same amount of space that we are not seeing any waveform. If I play this audio, we will see the second issue, sound only on the left channel. I have decided to make some audio editing tutorials with the Interestingly, the volume level of the bus and track is now the same, but we have sound only on the left channel. If you are using a headphone you will hear sound only on the left side of the headphone. So how do we get sound on the right side or right channel? To fix it, right click inside the clip. Choose clip attribute and a pop-up will appear. Make sure audio is selected in this pop-up and change the format. The format should be stereo. The source channel is mute for the second option and change it to the same as you see in the first channel. For me, it is embedded in channel 1. Click OK and all the problems will be fixed. If I now play this you will see both the track and bus volume level will be the same and sound will be back on both channels. I have decided to make some audio editing tutorials with DaVinci Resolve. Normally, I make audio editing tutorials with Audacity. I hope this video was useful and thanks for watching. See you next.